No, just the, the L, LCD screen. All right, whenever you're ready. All right. Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm going to show you my Makikomi. Actually, it's not mine. People do it all the time. I don't really do it that much. But since we're here with the resident Georgian, all right, do you want to say hi, Luca? To hi, everybody. everyone. Hi, everyone. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to do a Harai Makikomi from the Georgian grip, right? Harai Makikomi is something that people always request. And it's not a big fan. You know, I don't really like it for my guys doing it. Uh, just to show you what Harai Makikomi looks like. Okay, I go over. Boom. All right, this is sort of classic Harai Makikomi. Uh, it's a little bit dangerous, right? You throw your whole body weight down to sacrifice throw. A lot of the times, person who's taking the fall lands on the shoulder. If you miss it, person's on your back, you go flat on your stomach, and that's it. There's no recourse after that, right? It's sort of a ride or die, you know, one shot, that's it. You know, make or break sort of a attack situation. And sometimes the situation calls for that. But it's not just be best practices to go for it all the time because it doesn't lead to the next thing. Right? You don't end up in a good position once you fail. Right? And generally, you're not going to get every throw that you go for. Right? You want to have a recourse. So, the time I like to set this up is posting on the lapel hand first. Right? This is classic right versus right. Ipon uh, Senagi, snap down, two, right versus right, right dominant position. Right? This is sort of a classic position. I would never go for it from here. You have far too many options from here. It drives me crazy when people are in good position and they abandon this good position, go for her right mock, call me, ah, and then they maybe end up in this sort of a thing. Right and now, right, you just perfectly ruined a good opportunity to blast a person with some very strategical, technical stuff that you're capable of doing. Right? When I'm in this dominant position, right, I want to fake, back and forth, snap, right, move, cut angles, OG turn throw. Right, there's a lot of stuff that I, I can do, and even if I go for a harai or something, I can't get it, I can always come back out and go for something else, okay? The time I do want to secure the opponent and then go for something like a harai makikomi is when I'm sort of already in this very close Georgian grip position here, okay? Where I'm capable of controlling this person's posture, we're already very close hip to hip, and now when I go for this position, look, I throw my hips across and I trap this tricep and I throw my entire body weight over, okay? This proximity is the timing to go for a big harai makikomi. So, I have the collar, belt, I'm breaking his posture. As soon as I feel my opponent rise up, I'm gonna release, I'm gonna turn, throw my hips all the way across, I'm gonna catch this tricep, and throw my hips all the way to the floor. And I'm really gonna envision bringing my shoulder blades to the ground, okay? Because when I go for this technique, me and Luca sort of are attached, right? If I do it properly, uh, by sort of this link here, okay? This position between the collar and my arm cinching over, we're going to be attached by the shoulder here, okay? So the goal from this position is to throw my hips across to create a fulcrum here, and then bring the rest of my back to the floor, okay? I use my leaning body, boom! And I throw my entire body weight forward, and now I have a very, very powerful full body committed attack, and uh, yeah, that's, that's when you want to go for the Harai Makikomi, okay? As opposed to when you sort of already have this distance, right? Because from here, I'm dominant. I control his posture. I have a lot of good things going. I don't want to release it, let go, close this distance, secure this, and then go. Okay, that's just too much work. It's just too much distance. Uh, the likelihood of you getting it, not so good. Right? There's too much space and time for him to react to that kind of a technique. That's why I like, well, and on the lapel, Ipon Senahi, snap down, Georgian grip. And this is my timing to go for the big, big, big Harai Makikomi. Sometimes I might go Koji, okay? Sometimes I might go Sumi, okay? But generally speaking, if I'm connected at the upper body, I can throw my hips across and then go into the Harai Makikomi. All right, Luca? Close. Thank you. Close. 